when you think about Angeti, obviously the one dominant Bible personality is David. And his association with Angeti is that he was um, hiding from Saul. As we know, familiar story, no need to go through it. But I think what's fascinating about, don't forget, David was promised the throne of Israel. He was promised a crown would be his. He was promised a throne. And he must have thought, probably didn't know the logistics, how they would come about. There was already a king in Israel. But how can you even imagine you're promised to be a king and that you would spend at least 10 years of your life? That's roughly what it was. From the ages of 20 to 30 is when David got into uh, a bad way with Saul and he ran. By the time he got to En Gedi, kind of looking at the Bible, it was toward the end of that. Uh, we never read in the Psalms that he questions God, but we know that he was down. And again, just the idea, he was given this promise. And, and a, a glorious promise, a promise that he would be the king of Israel. He would have the crown, he would wear the crown. And yet, it's one thing you have to wait for it, but it's another thing to wait for it in hardship and in suffering and in danger. But yet he, he held on for his life. And I'm thinking, and Getty represents to me the low point of our lives as Christians. And if I can get that from Craig, James 1.12, we're also promised something. Blessed is the man who remains steadfast under trial, for when he has stood the test, he will receive the crown of life, which God has promised to those who love him. And again, the crown of life, whenever we read life in that way, especially in the New Testament, we're really looking on um, eternal life. So just as David was promised a crown, we are promised a crown of life, a crown of eternal life. And yet as we go through life, uh, we come up to all these burdens and trials that are laid on us. For instance, when I got saved 31 years ago, I was sure, I knew what the, I knew what the uh, results would be. I'm Jewish, so my family, I knew I was going to be banished from the family, and I was, except for the immediate family, but the rest of the family didn't. But I was positive, even though my parents are mad, they would come around. Well, within one year, they were both dead, both my parents in their 50s. They died young. Well, I figured, well, that would draw my siblings closer. Uh, three years ago, I finally spoke to my oldest sister for the first time, for the second time in 28 years. But God makes us a promise. Sometimes you just feel like hiding in a cave. You feel like running away. You say, God, this is a burden now. It wasn't at first. 31 years, Lord, you promised. Well, what did he promise? He never promised that our, um, he never promised that our loved ones would be saved, but he has promised us a crown of life. And I think with all the trials in life that we go through, all the burdens, and I know all of us here have loved ones that we're, or friends that we're still waiting for to come to the Lord. And you know, as you get older, first it's year by year, and then it becomes decade by decade. And when you get old enough, it's score by score. And, uh, but you keep hanging on, and you keep waiting, and we don't know what's gonna happen in life, but we do know when we get that crown of life, which is waiting for us, we don't know who's going to be there with us, but we do know that God is going to wipe away every tear when we are with Him in heaven. Heaven on earth and then eventually, I mean heaven up there and then heaven eventually on earth. But I keep thinking of the idea of this is promise of a crown that will be all of ours if we just persevere long enough. Tony got his two and a half weeks ago. And all of us will get ours no matter how bad it gets here. Some of us will get it in great joy and some of us will get in great pain. But we'll get there. And David got there. David eventually got his, his crown. He had to wait eventually. And Getty was probably the representation of his low point, if you read some of the Psalms that were generated from here, because uh, it was coming toward the end of his time. But he held on, and a crown awaited David, a crown awaits us, and we'll get there, just as Angeti is the is the reminder of that.